Hey guys, so today I want to talk about FOMO because I had a real FOMO when Rihanna's Puma Slides came out and they came out at like 7 in the morning. I was on the website by like 7.04 and they were sold out and I was kind of bummed about that. So, you know, if you can't join them, make them. So, look at that. clever. So I'm going to make some shoes inspired by them because ever since I saw them I've just been wanting like some fluffy slides. I don't know, I, I thought that was so cute and I just needed a pair. So I got these white Puma slides and at first I was like, do I really want to DIY these shoes because they're really cute already by themselves and Puma and it's like, it's, does that make sense? But they got dirty like the first day I wore them and I figured they're really high maintenance and I won't be able to wear them in like a month anyway because they're going to be like filthy. So I think they're actually great ones to DIY and they weren't expensive. I got them on ASOS. I'll put all the links below. So you'll just need the, it's like a white pair of slides. They don't have to be Puma. They could be anything. Scissors, a boa, and a glue gun. And that's all you need. Alright guys, I'm going to make one of these shoes, this, this, and stuff. Alright, let's do this. Warning, there will be feathers everywhere. So what I did was measure the boa against the shoe. You guys know I like to guesstimate. I hate measuring things unless it's absolutely necessary and most of the time it's not. So I just measure on the shoe a lot of times and then I took that length and just kind of measured it against the boa and cut a few pieces so that I had um, pieces that were similar size to put on the shoe. And you don't have to be exactly perfect because the boa is so like fluffy that if you end up being a little short you can just go back and add boa on the sides and no one can even tell. So when I started gluing I started from the middle because I wanted to make sure I covered everything and if you start from the top or the bottom you might end up like with a weird space left behind so in my logic I thought it would be best to start from the middle and I ended up only needing three pieces of boa for the shoe so I started from the middle and then I glued in the front and then I glued the one in the back the thing when gluing is you want to glue at least halfway and then place the boa and then glue the rest of the way and then place the, glue, um, the boa and press it firmly down. You don't want to do like the whole glue the whole thing and then have to go back and put the boa. It gets really messy. Like I mentioned, there's going to be feathers everywhere and they're going to get stuck in the glue and you're kind of trying to alleviate the amount of mess that you're making and the amount of feathers that get stuck literally everywhere. have the boa on like you want it you just wait a few minutes to let it dry not too long maybe like one or two minutes you just want to make sure it's on there and then you go and you give it a haircut I mean you can leave it fluffy if you want it was just a little too fluffy for me and I wanted it to, it to look more like the Rihanna Puma slide so I didn't want it to be as foo-foo you know so I just went over it and gave it a little haircut and this was actually my favorite part I don't know why I had so much fun cutting this boa but I just went at it I feel like in another life it should have been a hairdresser but yeah you just snip snip and you can do it to your liking you can do it as long or as short as you want Final product, some furry slides. I think 
they came out really cool you know they're not exactly like the Rihanna ones but they'll have to do because I missed the deadline like I'm sure many of you did so if you're like me and you missed out there you go so don't forget to subscribe thank you guys so much for watching this video give it a thumbs up if you like it share it with your friends and if you try it send me a dm slide into my dm i want to see i love when you guys um share with me your diys i really do love it make sure you check out my other diys the last one i did were um pearl sandals and i'm working on some more for you right now so stay tuned come back see me soon i'll see you guys later bye